Welcome back to the show. My first guest tonight has been in office for nearly two decades. He is a true son of Marshall. Please welcome Senator Bob Plymel. <laughs> Senator, thank you for coming on the show. This is Zippy. Nice to see you. Sit right here. Thank you for coming on the show. We really appreciate it. And you don't mind that Governor Manchin came on our show this past April and he had his motorcycle come down the hallway and you just, what'd you do? Well, you know, that's the difference between a uh, governor and a senator. We don't get the, uh, the mode of transportation that he does. I had to walk. He had to walk. Well, that's okay. It's not that far from the Ray Hall Institute, just right down the road, just right? Down the, just down the street. Well, thank you very much for coming on the show. And I want to say something at, at the very beginning. Thank you. Let everyone at home know, this, earlier this week, you secured $800,000 for the W. Page Pitt School of Journalism and Mass Communications to help us converge into the digital era. We thank you very much for that. I'm going to let you know, Uplate can be really funny with $800,000. So thank you very much. It may take a little bit more than that. Uh, you know, <laughs> may, maybe you need a little bit more than 800000 Senator Plymo, everybody, let's, let's thank him. Thank you for being on the show. We'll be right back. <laughs> Look at you working the crowd. No, seriously, thank you for what you did. How, I mean, $800,000, that's a lot of money. How did you secure that? Well, um, it is a little interesting. Um, we were going through this a couple of times in the... Uh, uh, session and when we do supplementals, we uh, looked at it, uh, started thinking about that, and then went to Beckley to start with the WSWP. And I said that if we need it here, let's get it. And we did uh, in June. So uh, it happened at the governor's mansion when we were in a leadership meeting. And you bring it up, and th th they said that they supported it. So we got it in the budget the day after. Unbelievable. That is a lot of zeros, as somebody said during the press conference. Now, this isn't the first time that you've helped out Marshall. You've been doing this your entire career. And you're also a Marshall grad, correct? Yes, I am. Now, you just grew up right down the road? Yes, I did. Let's talk about that, being the homegrown boy going to the Marshall University. Yeah, yeah, that's, uh, that was, uh, that's been brought up a couple times. Uh, <laughs> um, actually, from uh, Cerrito Canova High School. And... Uh, from Cerrito Canova, I went to Marshall, and then after Marshall, I got into into business, and later led into the Ray Hall Transportation Institute. Now, you you've done such a good job, and, and everyone here loves you so much. You were inducted to the Marshall University Alumni Hall of Fame back in 2005. Yes, unbelievable. What the what the university does is they show videos like a "This Is Your Life" type of video. We don't have that. Uh, I tried searching for it, but. It would be a short video, probably. Actually, I'm getting a nod from my stage manager. We do have a video. Would you like to take a look real quick? Let's oh, see no, some of these. No, no. Let's take a look at some of these embarrassing <laughs> pictures back here. Ah, there he yeah. is. Nice little boy there. Now, I think the next picture is, is a little bit older. Okay. Now, you wanted to be quarterback uh, at the uh, CK Wonders, right? Uh, <laughs> yes. Uh, I was a little bit. <laughs> and basketball player there. And there you well, are. Well, that's the, the humorous side, the and coaching side. And there is your family there. Yes. So not too bad. Long, long history there. Yeah. <laughs> Thank goodness you didn't have more. <laughs> no, we, we, we cut it at that. But this isn't the first time. You kind of alluded to it a second ago that you've been in this comedic type of, well, I don't know if it's comedic or not, but this type of atmosphere. This past February, the infamous Jiminy Glick had you on stage yes. at the Keith Albion and got to give you a hard time. Well, How was that? I've been abused before, um, <laughs> is what I say, that... Uh, no, it was interesting. Uh, I, I was very impressed with uh, Martin Short. Um, my son's favorite person that he depicts is Jiminy Glick. So uh, you know that you're going to get abused when you go with Martin Short as uh, when he plays out the Jiminy Glick story. So it was an interesting time. You know, he, he asked me many questions uh, that uh, where were you from, you know, where did you grow up, uh, where did you go to college, and in each one of those I answered uh, Huntington, uh, and uh, he said, uh, you know, you don't get around much, <laughs> and uh, the next question, the next thing he said to me, he said, uh, you're no Magellan, are yeah. you? Uh, so you just took abuse the whole evening, and you, you laughed at it. And, and, and the bad thing was, though, you didn't know of his character until that day, right? Now, about an hour and a half before we went on, and no pre you know, he didn't prep you on what he was going to say, any questions he was going to ask. Uh, you know, he, he asked uh, some, some very interesting questions. You know, he, he said, I see that you have three, three children. I take it you're straight. And, uh, <laughs> you know, all these kinds of things. So, uh, you know, he, 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 he took that uh, nice right to the heart. You enjoy that, though. <laughs> no, I do. You, you, if you can't laugh at yourself, you can't laugh. You know, you can't have any humor or you can't uh, enjoy life. 
Not bad. And, and you're also co-president of, of the Keith Albee down there where they yes, had that venue. That place is amazing, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. And one of the first things that we wanted to do was we wanted to make sure the Marshall community, and particularly the students, used it. So we've really made it a very reduced rate for Marshall activities. Well, Senator DePlima, we thank you very much for all that you do and seriously for the, the generous donation that, that we got earlier this week. We're going to try to do a good job and, and do you proud. Maybe you can come back on when we get all the cameras in. And, I'll be glad to. And it'll be 2017 probably, but we'll have you back on. I'm, I may not be in the legislature then. Senator DePlima, everybody. <laughs> thank you. We'll be right